This is Roger with Wheel Kinetics in Tucson, Arizona. We're selling this truck as a 2002 Ford F-350 crew cab short bed. It's an XLT, which is cloth. It's a 7.3 liter turbo diesel. It's four wheel drive. It has 205,900 miles. It's a theft recovery purchased directly from an insurance company in uh, Phoenix. And it's on a salvage tile due to theft, not collision. Um, please watch the uh, little animated video we have on the topic. You'll uh, see why. But basically it's the attorneys for the insurance companies. They do not want this car coming back on them, so they uh, give it a salvage title. Um, that way they're implying no warranty when they sell it to us, and that way there's no implied, implied warranty going to you. Uh, it's basically their way of divorcing the truck. It has nothing to do with the vehicle. There'd be four pictures of it in our ad. Before it left Phoenix, it looks exactly like this. Uh, let's see, we bring them here, we do an inspection. This is what the inspection looks like. By the way, it's about 110. It's a nice day. Um, anyway, we did our inspection, uh, about two hours, wheels off, in the air, driving, the whole bit. This is what we found. Um, we gave it a Rotella oil change and filter, front and rear brake pads, sway bar links, stabilizer strut, ignition uh, was broken when they stole it, as was the uh, driver door handle and the door lock cylinder in the driver door handle. Those are new. Wiper blades are new. Uh, and then we needed, there was a crack or something in the uh, passenger tail light so we put a we had a used tail light here so we put that in and I think that the cops took a knife to the back of the seats not the not the parts you sit on but behind the front seats and tore them so we had to recover the, the back of the seats sometimes they stuff dope in there when they steal vehicles and so that is there uh, I'll show you I'm gonna walk around. I'm gonna point at stuff that I that I notice. There's not a whole lot to notice. This is a really clean truck, really clean. My brother's gonna take this out for uh, probably 50 to 70 HD pictures. In that gallery, you'll see a magnifying glass, which will allow you to zoom in on uh, anything that you see. And it's basically like putting your face right up against it. So cosmetically. It's uh, pretty easy to see whatever you want to see. Um, there's not a whole lot to point at. Little tiny ding here. Whoever owned this truck did pretty good care of it for a for a 2002, 200,000 miles, which obviously on a 7.3, if it's taken care of, isn't very much. That's why this truck will be sold so quickly. This is a really clean truck. The point of these videos is not to sell the truck. Uh, it's more to inform you, let you make the decision. Uh, I don't sit here and tell you. There's a little ding right here. I don't know if you can see that or not. I do my best to point everything out. Um, the point of this video is, is really just to make sure that the right person buys the vehicle. It is not to uh, tell you that it's the greatest truck in the world. It's to give you uh, a lot of information and then out of the five or six hundred people, this car, this truck's gonna get a thousand hits a day. Uh, most of them get three or four hundred a day. This one will get a thousand because of what it is, which is why you should be ready with your deposit the minute you, uh, you, uh, we have a accepted deal and we've decided on a price, two hundred five five ninety. Because it's gonna be a pretty quick one here. I'm going to take off the uh, oil cap, look for a blow by. Everyone wants to see that. That's beautiful. That is almost zero blow by, which is very rare in a 7.3 with 200,000 miles. There's your Ford stamp there, Ford stamp there, stickers where they belong. That's an original battery. This is a new battery. All the stickers where they belong. Ford stamp there. It's a nice truck. All right. Seats. A little tear in the headliner right here.
seat's in great shape. This truck is going to be very quick, so please be ready to fire away with your deposit. Um, this is definitely one of those where it's going to be a race. I've seen this about two or three hundred times every year. This exact truck, and we sold this a million times. And this is a really nice version of the truck we sold a million times. This is a nice truck. There's out, in, down, up. Other side, out, in, up, down, door locks. There we go. All right, what else we got here? Seats are in good shape. A little bit of foam broken down here, but not too bad. But, uh, let's see, here's your tilt wheel. There you go. All right. People always want to know what they look for. And so, when I have the time in a video, and I do now, um, we give you the Kelly. There's a short bed, uh, 205,900 miles. Suggested retail price is $14,206. There's your equipment, XLT, off road package. That'll all be in the ad, also in, tech, in the text of the ad. Let's see, make sure there's no surprises there. There's not. There's a penny. All right. So I've made my first penny on this truck. Yay. Right on. Oh, it's got decimal pedal pedals here. Up. Down. All right. So that works. Wow, it's hot. No sissies and crybabies allowed in Arizona for the next two months. Three months, actually. All right, let me try the air on the higher settings. It's blowing ice cold, and it's a beautiful thing. I put it there so you can hear me, but the minute I turn this video off, cassette player, CD player, the minute I turn this video off, it's going on. There's your uh, overdrive off and on. Got Cruise. I mean, you got cruise control here, and obviously I already showed you the tilt. All right, I'm gonna put it in neutral. We go to four low. Now we're in four low. That's what that is, right up there. We can already feel this truck is tight. I like this truck. That's in four low, that's in drive. Reverse in four low. That's definitely four low. All right, neutral. Now we're gonna go to four high. Now we're four high. There we go. A little bit faster there. Four high and reverse. All right, neutral. Now we're gonna go to two wheel drive. And let's go for a drive. All right, if you come to Tucson, what you're welcome to do, obviously I showed you the tire condition. I would say that if you're gonna drive it out of town, uh, if you're going to leave Tucson, you really need to go and get tires. If you go to DiscountTire.com online, there's a store. Uh, uh, their closest uh, store is on uh, Prince Road and Oracle. Call them. Tell them you're with Wheel Kinetics. Pay for them over the phone. Uh, you won't pay taxes that way. Uh, and you'll probably get a 5 or 10% discount on the price you see online. Um, I think these are 16s on this thing, I believe. So a decent set of tires, as long as you don't want to go with name brand, are probably going to be five or six hundred bucks, maybe six fifty. Um, but uh, yeah, if you're going to drive it on the interstate, you definitely need to do that because they're not looking so hot. Uh, if you uh, buy them online, we'll get it over there for you before you come here to fly it, to fly in or drive it to drive it home, or even before it ships out. If you want to put tires on before it ships out. Um, what else? Uh, blah, 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 blah. So, all right, if you want to drive it home, now we'll talk about the money part about driving home. If you drive it home, we cannot issue you plates and you can't get insurance on a salvage title, which is what it's at right now. Um, we need to give it a level three inspection, which is what the cops do here. Um, we charge $200 to do that for you. It ties our guy up for about four to six hours. Um, it costs us $50 to the state, and then 150 covers our guy being 
gone anywhere from four to six hours, sometimes 10 or 12, depending on whether the cops have an emergency or not. Um, so it's $200 to restore the title, that's mandatory. There's a $250 uh, dock fee, and then there's taxes. Taxes are 2% city tax here in Tucson, plus whatever your state tax rate is. So basically, you know, if your state tax rate is 2%, you'll pay four. You'll pay our city of two, your state of, of uh, your state of two, and you'll have 4% total. Just add 2% to your state, $250 dog fee, and then 200 to restore the title, and you'll know what you're gonna pay before, if you're gonna do, uh, drive it home. Uh, if you're gonna pay by wire and ship, all you're gonna pay is a green pump price. If you want us to restore the title before it leaves, um, add $200, there's a little tab to click on to restore the title, and we'll get it done for you before it leaves. Um, once we receive your wire, uh, we will uh, fill in the title with your name or company's name and address. We'll sign it off, notarize it, scan it into your online file so you'll be able to see it immediately, what it looks like. Um, then we will mail it to you. We even scan the uh, envelope that we mail it in, um, you will see. Uh, what else? Deposit. Deposit's $500. Once we receive a deposit, we have a deal. This guy's riding his bike and he's got his 12-pack of Budweiser. There you go. That's a successful man right there. Jesus. That's not good. Uh, anyway, uh, once we receive your deposit, we'll put your name in a banner over the truck at wheelconnects.com and you'll know it's yours. Until then, it's for sale. All right, so please get your deposit in. The last thing I'm going to say is about warranty. There is no warranty. Uh, there is some risk involved here. Uh, if you're not willing to accept some risk, please just avoid everything in our inventory. I can't tell you that anything we have isn't going to break tomorrow or right now. I don't know. Uh, we have a lot of experience. We know good ones. We know bad ones. But we don't know the future, okay? Uh, the people who built this gave it X amount of miles and X amount of years at Ford, and it's way past that on their warranty, okay? If they could have given it a 25-year, 500,000-mile warranty, they would have. They didn't because they didn't know what would happen. And if the guys who built it didn't know, how the hell do we know more than they do? Um, <laughs> so... Uh, we give you tons of information. We give you this driving video, lots of pictures. We'll have the title in the ad. We'll have uh, uh, a lot of pictures, great pictures, HD pictures you can zoom in on. Not much more we can do, okay? Uh, but if it shows up to your house and it breaks, the second you get it, go get it fixed because we are not paying you to, uh, a dime. We're not giving you a check. We're not giving you anything. And if you watch all the videos on all these vehicles that we're selling, I say the same thing. I'm not singling out this truck, okay? Um, it's just what I have to say so I get the right people to buy our vehicles. We need people who understand uh, diesel. Um, if you don't understand diesel, that's okay, but ask somebody so that... that you know you're you're informed and you know what's going on all right uh, you just saw this thing it runs great what it needs is a set of tires um, we would buy tires and put them on except every time we buy tires people say oh I wanted a different set of tires I wanted off-road or I wanted a you know Michelin's and we'll go and get you know Hankook's or Falcons or some Chinese tire or something because they're five or six hundred bucks and they're fine and people just take them off and and you know wish we'd never done it so the tires are on you uh and uh that's about you know what i never tried the radio did i radio works fine all right anyway there you go thank you for your time